tag, you're it. Okay. If you don't tag me back, I will find you, and I will kill you. Hello, people of the internet. I'm DMZ Geek, and I'm gonna be honest. I get tagged in way too many of those posts. You know, those posts flooding Instagram and Facebook and Snapchat and probably other social media that I refuse to let eat away at the few precious moments of free time I can still claim. The posts that say something along the lines of Tag your 15 favorite people. If they tag you back, they are true friends. I don't know why the beard was there. Listen, whether or not I tag you back in that post is irrelevant in the grand scheme of our friendship. This may sound off topic, but hear me out. I don't want a friend who I'm gonna have a single conversation with and then never talk to again. Whenever I go into a friendship, I have every intention of staying friends with that person for the rest of our lives. Things may not always go as planned, but that's my thought process. I intend to be there in your times of need. Weather the storm with that person and have a stronger connection with them because of it. We're gonna be so close that- oh, nope. They didn't tag me back. It's over. What? Those posts, in the grand scheme of our friendship, are like a little speck of dust laying on a bunch of other little specks of dust in a pile collected on my untouched classical music collection sitting on a shelf in the corner. That was not a shot against classical music. They're all just posts written by an 11 year old trying to find out if his 15 year old crush who followed him on Instagram out of pity likes him too. They should not be what makes or breaks our friendship. You didn't not get the notification that I tagged you in the post when I reposted it because I didn't tag you. You didn't get the notification because I didn't repost it. I'm not gonna give in to that. I'm flattered that I'm one of your 15 favorite people, but a lot more than 15 people follow me on Instagram. It's like at least 20. One. So at least six people are gonna be offended that I think less of them than others. For an exact number of people who follow me, follow me yourself. Link in the description. I'll be right back after this short message. And now a message from the man behind DMZ Geek. I just love channels like Markiplier, The Game Theorists, and Good Mythical Morning. And when I like a channel, I subscribe to it. It helps them to grow in popularity, and it helps me to have a good time. Support the channels you like, subscribe to DMZ Geek. Stay in school, kids. Welcome back! You know what else I hate? Chain mail. If you repost this, you'll have a great day, but if you don't, you'll literally be put as number one on every mob boss's hit list. I highly doubt that. People are just trying to scare you into reposting at this point. <laughs> repost this for a good day. But if you don't, something unwelcome will find you. Don't even think about strolling past this. You can't ignore it. It will find you. So, be smart. Repost. Can you stop? I don't want to feel like I'm gonna die every time I don't repost something like that. And I'm not going to repost stuff like that! Chainmail and... Tag? Fishing? I'm not really sure what you call it. They just need to stop existing. That's all I really had to say. But remember this. Make sure you share this video with your friends. After all, sharing is caring. Thanks for letting me waste your time. Like this video, share it with your friends, and comment down below telling me what I should talk about next. Subscribe to become part of my geekdom, and ring that little bell down below to get notified whenever I post a new video. I'm DMZ Geek, and this is me bidding you, uh... I do. This thing's on, right? Okay, good.